Well, hello again. This is my third video for today because I'm trying to get caught up. But this is Cad Caddy Marie P. My name's Kathy McCuller, and I'm going to do this little Dollar Tree video. Uh, I went probably a week ago now because I wanted to get my grandbabies, uh, they're both girls, a uh, something for Halloween, like a little basket of just goodies in it. You know, just, I didn't get them any food because uh, the youngest is not even three months old yet. And the oldest is almost two. But the only thing I got her was some cotton candy. I didn't want to load her up on all that sugar. And they really didn't have many, uh, which I, I considered some graham crackers and stuff like that. Maybe some, uh, uh, you know, the little beef sticks that you chew on. But I wasn't really sure if uh, her mom and dad would be agreeable to that. So I just kind of held back on any kind of food and got her the cotton candy because she's had that before and you know, that's easy to eat. So the first thing I did is I went by and I got them a Halloween card. And although I could have just took this to their house, I wanted them to have the experience, the two year old, of receiving mail. So, I got this little spooky Halloween card. It's got Frankenstein, a ghost, a, a mummy, black cat, pumpkin, spider, spider web. I thought that was cute. And Frankenstein is waving out the window. And it says, tis the season to be spooky. And um, the inside just says Happy Halloween. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my seal and wax, my wax seal that I bought from Timu, and go ahead and, you know, stamp it with that seal. So, she'll be able to see that, too, and understand what that's all about. She's very inquisitive. And, and wants to know, you know, what's this, what's that, that kind of thing. So I got that, dollar and a quarter. Something like this at the other places would probably be six to eight dollars. Four, let me say, let me say four to six dollars, probably. I mean, okay, so that was, that was a good idea. And I went ahead and got them some Halloween baskets you know, a little bucket to carry. And this is the one that I got for the two-year-old, the almost two-year-old. Look at uh, the wolf and the witch. And see, they're all kind of happy. Bats and the mummy and the tree. And then there's good old Frankenstein. And, oh, Count Dracula. Okay. And a little, I guess that's just a little beat up boy. I'm not sure what that is or if he's got a name. Pumpkins. So, again, dollar and a quarter. All right. So, I got this for the two year old. <laughs> She'll have fun with that. And this is something that mom and daddy can get involved in too. Especially daddy. He loves playing with her. And they're both just so funny together. And then I got her. She loves stickers. She's at that age. So look at these nice stickers for a dollar and a quarter. See? And they're all very, uh, uh, you know, detailed. I just thought that was such a good book of stickers. Okay. And then I got her some hair extensions. You've got a little braid there. And then you've got the hair extensions. And I wonder, 
I had wondered if these actually, um, sorry about the noise. I was going to try and get into this package. Uh, let me see if I can find my, no, I'm needing my little cutter. Let me just do it this way. It's stapled there, so. I wanted to know if the extensions hung off of the braid, and it does, yes. So see, <laughs> she will love this too. Put that around her head and let it hang back. That's that's a cute idea, y'all. So she'll she'll that she'll find that to be funny. We can get her picture in it. Okay. Dollar and a quarter. I wish they'd have stayed at a dollar. And I just wonder, too, if they're going to change their name. I guess they're not. I may have to fiddle with that later. But I, I really needed to know. I didn't know if maybe this was on, like, a clip that you put in your hair. So that's what I'd wanted to find out. Okay. And these are just stacking bows. They're cauldrons. It just says happy Halloween. But this almost two-year-old loves organizing. She will get, she will take these and stack them. Then she'll unstack them and put other things in them, like a little ball or a little toy. or, And it's just, that will keep her busy for, I don't know, a good 30 minutes. And uh, so I, I feel like she'll really like them too. And you get four for a dollar quarter. Okay. And then here's her little uh, uh, cotton candy. It's flavored of candy corn. And I always like to make sure that this, that anything edible is sealed. And it's got a plastic, you know, it's sealed all the way around with plastic and she'll enjoy once the cotton candies ate see she'll keep this and use it to stack with and put stuff in so that's a twofer and then these are felt stickers you know they're you can feel them they're soft there's a 20 in here Bats, black cats, pumpkins. I think that's all. So, she'll enjoy that. Now, there's something else back here, y'all. What is this? I think that's a ghost. Well, let me do this like I did the other one. Got a stapler and staple that back if I want to. So there's a pumpkin. Ooh, 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 ooh. And it's made with felt. Okay. And then we've got the bat. <laughs> Look how cute that is. And so these were pumpkins, I guess. I thought it was in the shape of a ghost. So you've got two kind of pumpkins. You've got, you've got these. So different faces and yeah, different matting. And then your black cat. Can y'all see that? There we go. So she'll really like those two. And now that I've opened them, I've got to, I'll have to figure that out. But anyhow, I'll figure that out. Okay. 
And then I got her a coloring book. She loves coloring already. And her mom and dad made her a little tackle box and has all of her coloring supplies in it. So I found this one and it's just called Halloween. And it's got all of the, you know, different characters in here that we all remember. There's your pumpkins and your wit or your cat on a broom. So she'll like this too. There's your mummy. Your cat ghost. She loves cats. Okay. This I got for my uh, carport door. This ghost. I thought that was just cute. It comes up with a little white hanger. You know, it's made pretty good. And if the wind tears it up or if it gets dirty or something, I mean, it's just a dollar and a quarter. You can just toss it and get another one next year. But I think my I, don't, I think mine will stay clean because uh, my carport, you know, is enclosed. So. so I got that for my carport door. And then where did my other one go? Well, oh, here it is. I got this one for my front door. And it's a house. It's a haunted house. It's just made out of cardboard. So I thought that was pretty. Okay. Got me some window clings, the little jelly. This is a, like a harvest theme, but it's front and back. It says you have 26 clings. So this will be pretty uh, the month of November on my carport door. Okay, so that's an idea. Running out of space. And then I had thought of doing this to my husband. I try to scare my husband around, uh, you know, Halloween time. But I think this is not going to do it. So I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but it says help. And what I was going to do is after he went to bed, I was going to go into his bathroom and put this on his mirror. That way, when he, if he woke up during the night to go to the bathroom or when he got up first thing to go to the bathroom, it might startle him a little bit. But since then, he's found this and he says, you're crazy. But had he not found it, I'd have still tried it. But uh, I don't know what I'll do with this. I may try to scare my uh, son with this somehow. <laughs> but it's a dollar quarter and uh, I just thought it might be neat maybe I can think of some way to to scare them okay and then for the baby for the uh, almost three month old oh let me show you these two things first I did get me this Halloween uh, mitten oven mitten It's black on the back. Thought that was cute. It's very thick and uh, will protect you, I think, good with holding that hot pan. And then I got me these socks. You've got a bat. I'm not sure. I think that's supposed to be Frankenstein. It says... Uh, Happy Halloween. 
So I thought, that, oh, that's supposed to be a wizard, I think. An owl wizard, maybe. Frankenstein. What is that supposed to be? I don't know what this one right here is supposed to be. Witch, maybe? But anyhow, I got those for me. And then my sweet little baby. I got her this cat. <laughs> Uh, and you know, afterwards, uh, you, you might could keep it for next year or you might could just put some of her toys in it or let the two-year-old play with it, of which she would. But for the baby, you know, it's hard to get Halloween stuff for the baby. So I just got her things that, uh, at her age. So this is a little teething ring. And look at the quality of this. It's a dollar quarter. And, I mean, if you get these at Walmart or Target or the pharmacy or where else can you get them? The dollar store, you know, dollar quarter. And then I got a teether, this little silicone teether. I thought that would be good. And I got her these little socks. And they've got little tread on the bottom. I mean, she's not going to be walking, but... It says newborn on the socks, so... I got her this little bib. I thought this was a little pricey, being that you just get one for a dollar and a quarter. And see, it's just... I would think they would have put... Maybe two. And then the blanket uh, matches. I got this little. Because see, this is a dollar and a quarter. And it's a little receiving blanket. And then this is a dollar and a quarter. I guess that's how they make their profit off of things. So got that. And I got her. This will be. This is a little ahead of the show but this is six months but this cute little spoon and fork set there goes my eye twitching again y'all ever have that done i may be doing too much of this camera stuff but anyway and then i'm just gonna you know put it all in the kitty cat and i'll show it to her She's at the age where she is just looking at everything around her. And she loves her little hand. She'll bring her little hand up to her and just look at that hand. It's the sweetest thing. Okay. I think that's all I got at the dollar store. So, uh... I've caught up, I think, for now. I did just get another delivery from Timu uh, as we sat here filming this one. <laughs> so I'll do that one tomorrow sometime. Put this up and get it ready. All right, so I want to take the time. I haven't said it since a few of my videos that um, I thank y'all for subscribing to my channel. And I hope that you enjoy the time that you spend watching this and uh, um, I hope that uh, you have a good Halloween and you have a good Thanksgiving although it's going to be a while for Thanksgiving to get here but uh, if you give me some comments I will get back to you with the comments and my son's calling me and I love you